everybody, Lorraine here. Welcome. I am seeing a lot of people doing what they call a balloon smash painting. And gotta join the bandwagon and try it myself. So I have covered this with white paint. And I don't know if I've seen anyone do it this way before, but I've got a piece of um, clear plastic here. It's like a file divider thing. And I'm going to just do a little puddle pour over here. I don't know if you can see me or not. Just do a couple puddles. This light magenta. I have a Naples yellow. And I have a phthalo blue. I've got two balloons. One's small. <laughs> the other one's blown up large. That was fun. Haven't blown up a balloon in a while. I am going to try. Let's see what happens here. I'll move it around a little. Looks pretty neat on the bottom. Ooh, I can see you got to have a pretty good grip on the balloon here. So, dip it. Looks like it kind of disappeared a little bit. So, notice that there is a learning curve with this. So, Let's see what happens. disappearing a little bit, isn't it? I'm going to try it with a smaller balloon, see how that turns out. Pretty colors together. not as happy as I'd like it to be. Let's do it a little different. <laughs> Make a little something happen here. Move it around. Eh, kind of all turned blue that time, didn't it? Yeah. So maybe this one takes a lot of practice. I wonder if this would be better on a dry canvas than having your paint on it first. You can just turn it into something else altogether here. So balloon smash, I don't think is quite my thing. Ooh, that looks neat. But you can always do something a little bit different with it. Selling up. It's pretty neat. Nice little cells up here. I want to 
keep putting stuff in there. I'll put right here. Let's see. I think I'm tilted a little bit because I pushed a lot of the white paint over there. Let's bring it down slow. Get kind of a bald spot right there. I like the way this looks but it is not a balloon smash. But the balloon has turned out to be a pretty useful tool for swiping these colors together. Try getting a little bit more pink in there on this, on this side of it. So that pink over there looks really nice. dripped in the middle. Didn't quite want to do that. Boy. These colors are so pretty together. And this really is looking very interesting. It's selling up over here and down here. Can I move this a little bit? Honestly, I think I'm going to leave it the way it is. Because I really like the way this turned out. So, Balloon Smash, one. <laughs> Lorraine, zero. But, I think I came out with something pretty cool looking, despite that. It's really pretty. Very, very pretty. Got little swirlies and... Tiny little lacing cells. Alright guys, thanks for visiting with me. If you like watching my videos, please subscribe. You can also share them with your friends. That would make me happy. Thank you for coming. Bye. Okay guys, I realized that I did not give you any kind of close-up of this. So if you look right here, some really nice features it's selling up right there. No wispy. Sorry, I've got a little glare going on here. Move my light back. So it's glaring right on it. Nice little lacing right there with a wave. Again, thanks for watching.